Kaizo block me? No Kaizo block. <gasps> oh man. <laughs> True ending get. The truest of all endings is being crushed by a falling moon. I like that. That's super funny. <laughs> I, I didn't do it. I was, uh, I was actually trying to be careful there. In that pipe. Fish. Whew, glad I didn't spend like an hour on that. Uh, that needs to be a spin <laughs> I have the feeling this might be the one. Shoot. Alright, first try. <laughs> See, what we're going to do is I'm going to uh, here on Twitch. There is an extension on screen. Uh, it just looks like a little button and you can click on that. There's an option there for coins. You can get 50 free coins to buy effects with. And I've tried to price it so that. OK, what are my buttons? It's it's only my buttons that are inverted. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, jeez. Well, that's easy. There we go. So, uh, poison mushrooms bounce in 3D world. So after I finish this level, hold right, there we go. All right, so you probably have never seen these green beans before. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I spoiled the surprise. <laughs> Uh, so I have no idea what the story is with this diagonal green. Oh, you can get it. Huh. I mean, at this point. All right. I 
think that I'm ready to get started. Everything should be working properly. My, uh... I'm gonna switch over to the other timer layout. Uh, Dominica, I have absolutely no idea what that is, so I think I'll be okay. So, I am a little bit late to the ROM hack race tonight, but this is the level that is still currently being raced. I'm not actually going to enter because, um, I'm actually quite late. <clears throat> but, I was looking forward to this level, and gosh darn it, I'm going to play it. So, let me just make sure I've got one last thing turned on. And we are good to go. All right. Three, two, one, go. Uh, hey there, John. So this is a cape level. Oh, very interesting. Okay. So, um... I'm actually going to be prevented from gaining any height when I jump because of this Metroid. Oh. This is going to be cool. So, um, you notice I can't gain height by jumping. So I literally can't jump into the munchers. And what that's going to allow me to do is uh, gain flight and immediately start sliding. Okay, that doesn't last forever, but I need to get more speed going through there. So, this is not exactly a rum hack. This is a level that was created for an event that's going on right now. Um, I'm actually not taking part in that event because I'm just late. Uh, late getting started. Okay. That needs to be flight. How was the work emergency? It was fine. There was, uh, there was very little that actually needed to be done, but I needed to be able to do it at a moment's notice. Yo, RNG. I think that's actually going to be regular flight, and I'm very interested to see how that's going to work out. What is this game called? This is a ROM hack. Uh, this is ROM hack race week 287. This is called, um... Attachment Issues? I think it is Sticky Fly. But I think it's going to be a completely free sticky fly. I just need to actually get it. Because um, the Metroid that's stuck to my head is preventing me from jumping. Or from... More accurately, it's preventing me from gaining height while I jump. No, I'm playing this with a PS4 controller. Okay, so there, that's Sticky Fly. Thanks, Bull Run. Um, I could use an SNES controller, but I don't own one. That's really cool. I like that a lot. Uh, ordinarily, I would say that... Uh, 
I would be a stickler for not having any kind of backseating during a race level, but I'm not actually taking part in this race, so it doesn't matter. Good luck. Hmm, says Bullrun. So I play on a Super NT, which is like a hardware clone of a Super Nintendo. You're gonna go eat, you might check it out yourself. Uh, Romhackraces.com if you want it. Wait, it actually might be .net. Yeah, excuse me, romhackraces.com. Uh, this was made specifically for the event, and nobody's seen it before tonight. I need less height there. Which means I pretty much just need to neutral as soon as I leave the edge of that platform. I might also not even need to jump. Hello from Indiana. Welcome on in. Hey, Marsha, how are you? Is this Mario 3? It is not. This is a ROM hack of Super Mario World. You can tell it's not Mario 3, because if I was playing Mario 3 with warps, I'd get so many views. That That's a joke, by the way. How do I get less height there? <clears throat> Your name is actually Tyler. Okay. Well, I guess you could see why I'd be confused. So that vine is automatically moving up. It's pulling me up. We made two grilled cheese sandwiches. <laughs> I was gonna ask how to do a grilled cheese wing. <laughs> Okay. Um, so it looks like I'm probably going to hit a P-switch, and then that pipe is probably my goal for this section. We'll see how to get there. Thank you, Mac. I don't need much speed. Yeah, I've not really spent very much uh, time playing the Switch versions of the 
NES or SNES games. I did go back to regular Super Mario World not too long ago just for some speedrun practicing. Just for fun. What are you saying, Dubs? Oh, gotcha. Three streak? That's a pretty long streak. I don't know if anybody could ever have a longer streak than that. You're exhausted, but you didn't even do Stardew Valley yesterday. Dang, Fireflower. The color is different on the Switch. Um, maybe slightly, but it's probably more just your TV. That's really tight, having to uh, stay under the flowers but over the goop. The world might already have enough uh, Tylers. Body. Oh no, you're probably thinking about about a difficult game about climbing. Because <laughs> that's all the rage these days. keep all my height for that P-switch. <laughs> uh, Bull Run Mr. Germ Dove is actually my father. not the idea. Yeah, 
And the pipe! Alright, my idea worked. I need to keep flight through that pipe. I thought that going in the pipe would definitely give me a midway so I didn't have to do this part anymore. And I was incorrect. I'm not familiar with that service. Just as surprised as you are that I have to do this again. Oops. I don't know how I would keep flight going in that pipe, is the thing. Sticky Nicky. Yeah, I think I'm going to prefer to just try to do this fast. Hey, thanks, Old Red. Have a good night. I didn't jump, like, at all. Often do I usually do, co do cooking streams? My goal is to aim for one a week, and I'm probably gonna miss next week. Hi, Al. Do I know what I'm making next? Uh, I need to write it down. 
but I had a suggestion for doing risotto, and I think that would actually be a really good idea. How's the race level? This seems really cool so far. Um, I've gotten into a pipe. This pipe. It's actually going to be way easier to fly early than to try to time it with running off the edge. I'm basically Metroid, yeah. <laughs> uh, Metroid is a pretty cool guy. He shoots the aliens and doesn't afraid of anything. Anyone? Doesn't afraid of anyone? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Dobbs. <laughs> yeah, risotto I think would be a good uh good choice. That was Day's suggestion. <laughs> Unfortunately, yeah. I basically already have everything I need to make risotto, but, um, I would want mushrooms. I love a good mushroom risotto. I think I was going to be too high there. Maybe I'm not going fast enough. Maybe my height doesn't have anything to do with it. But it might be... That might actually be it. would need to press the p-switch before getting in that pipe pressing the p-switch is definitely going to cause me to lose my flight <clears throat> and I didn't get a super good look at what was beyond the pipe I got in there and basically just fell straight to my death yo thanks Nix I wish I'd gotten a chance to actually join the race but some work came up. This is a super cool gimmick. I do normally join the races, yeah. I usually do pretty well on them, too. Yo, Patron. 
Just doing the race level. It's Hillary. Hillary is first. In case anybody was wondering. Dang it, pencil. So I've gotten in the pipe once. Um, I was too busy celebrating when I got in the pipe because I was expecting it to be a midway. And I learned it is not a midway. <laughs> what kind of sicko indeed. Yes, yes. Uh, that is a Metroid. You might know Metroid from the exploits in the video game Metroid. <laughs> Willatron. <laughs> uh, you might also know it from Kid Icarus. Uh, they were called Kamados in that game. <laughs> All these Metroids and no Ice Flower power up. Can't do anything before you freeze him. That's <laughs> too fast. <laughs> better about slowing down. Oh, I feel like I'm normally uh, killing the saw at this point. How was brunch? Uh, if you're referring to the meal that I cooked on stream, it was delicious. Because I feel like you can't really go wrong with making a grilled cheese sandwich and deviled eggs. I thought by some miracle I'd be high enough. Oh, I'm definitely getting into 100 tries. This level took, uh, very nearly an hour to beat for some of the most talented players out there. That's so dumb. I was uh, I was getting ready to drop it, so I wanted to let go of my my back input. That caused me to drop my flight.
Well done, Annie. I love that, uh, I can do the ROM hack races and constantly find new stuff that I've never done before. Miso deviled eggs? Oh, those sound really good. Miso is, uh, difficult for me to buy where I am. I've actually not found it at any local grocery stores. I'm too low. Yeah, you did a good job, Nyx. Way more original than, uh, the level concept that I'm thinking of for, uh, for a race level. Going through the, the fire flowers, I'm not doing a very good job at uh, keeping up my speed. Except just then. I did a really good job that time. I was too low to grab onto the vine. I'm pretty sure, at least. <clears throat> if I take damage off of the saw... That's going to be the fastest way for me to get through here. Instead of killing it with a slide kill, like, or, uh... Cape slide kill, I guess?
Oops. Got an extra cape in there. I guess I can try to line up for the right height uh, on the first set of pencils. Probably should just not jump there, I'll be fine. Too low. Okay. I see a better lineup than what I was trying to do. Chief. Too low. Thank you for the Luishis. What's the bubble that sticks to me? It's a Metroid. And what it does is it prevents me from gaining any height as I jump. Or at least... It prevents me from gaining most height as I jump. And what that's allowing me to do is spin fly underneath all these munchers without getting hit. And um, basically do a... a version of sticky fly that can be activated anywhere. Because it's like I'm hitting a ceiling. Thank you for the heart, man. You were watching me cook earlier? Nice. <laughs> the, uh, the cooking stream was, um... To me, it was very funny. Because it's boiling eggs and making a grilled cheese sandwich. What are you making, Chief? Still delicious, but uh, I don't think it's the kind of thing that uh, I don't know. It, 
I guess I kind of want to show off when I cook on stream, but I don't really have to. Hello, Raiders, Lord Hoyle, and your whole crew. Um, I actually don't even know what you were playing tonight, Patrick. Hello to all the kitties and puppies in the area that can hear me. You are all good babies. Oh man, that sounds really good, Chief. SMW crowd control. Oh, I guess... <laughs> Sorry. I was gonna make fun of Patrick for a second. Because, uh... He sends a raid and then he never joins. Is this on 3DS? Uh, you could put it on 3DS, but I'm not playing on 3DS. Streaming a 3DS game is, um... Not exactly trivial. Welcome back to Norse Cowboy. Okay, why don't I just slow down? Wouldn't that be a lot easier? Kind of. <laughs> Give me one quick second. I felt like I was a little too high. And I, I was too high. Switch. I wish I could tap the B button faster. That would make it easier for me to slow down. But, uh... Tapping buttons quickly while I'm... Uh, holding a different button is not something that comes easy for me. <clears throat> oh. 
If I'm going fast like that, I need to stop jumping. Because it's unnecessary and it's messing me up a little bit. I'm sliding off the edge, which is putting me in a weird flight state. That was too slow. Sorry. Confused because you haven't been filtered in two days. Maybe that's their way of uh, reforming accounts. <clears throat> they take their worst defenders and they try to scare them and then they figure their work is done. Switch. <laughs> I didn't know that you had that many alts. Hey, Huda, thank you so much for the love you gift. Appreciate it. Hey, Ken, how you doing? the speed. Yeah. I should have sped up. It's just speeding up is kind of risky. Stopped. 
I messed up. So there's, um, whenever Mario lets go of any item, there's a, there's a timer that lasts, I think, for 16 frames? Where he cannot, uh, re-interact with the, the thing that he let go of. And that's the thing that's getting me right now. Um, I, I need the P-Switch to fall down through Mario's feet and activate um, by falling through his feet. the itchy nose. I personally blame my cat. He is shedding a lot. Why don't I wait until the piece which is already inside the wall before dropping it? I feel like I really learned anything. I need to take another look at uh, what this looks like. Do I need to get back to the left? That seems really unlikely. <laughs> This is not normal cape. Yeah, that that P switch is on the same the same height as the tile right above the munchers. That's not going to work. I don't think... I 
I don't think that the P switch stays active when going through pipes. Just because of how SNW works. I could be mistaken, but I don't think I am. <laughs> well, I'm glad you had a chance to try it. So, uh, I like to do hard-boiled eggs just a little bit under, um, usually like 10 or 11 if I'm just eating them, but if they're going into deviled eggs, they have to be fully cooked. Like the, uh, the yolks have to be fully cooked. Here the follow. I have not tried Harley Humongous, no. It was a long time ago that you first brought that up. We'll try it. We'll try uh, waiting before going in the pipe. makes some sense but I don't understand like I kind of get it I need to I need to bring a p-switch with me so I was right before um, the p-switch does not stay active going through a pipe but I can carry the p-switch with me which definitely feels like something that Nix would want me to do um, it looks like there's a sprite killer up in the top left. And I'm kind of making the assumption that that sprite killer is going to get rid of the Metroids. I'm naturally gravitating over to the right. Maybe if I drift to the left first, the Metroids will hit the sprite killer. And then I can jump after that. It's about the only thing I can think of right now. I didn't get the P-switch. Why are there Metroids? So the Metroids are the, um, the big gimmick of the level. 
they attach to me and it prevents me from gaining pretty much any height from jumping. Hey, uh, Lorraine. Melissa. I'm doing pretty well. So, something important happened there. We got rid of the first Metroid and we dodged the second one. Which I think is going to let me damage boost on those munchers. And then possibly jump over the third one. I think we're about to make progress. The baby Metroids are pretty cute. Cape those flowers right now. Just slightly too late every time. I guess I'm pressing back too early when I'm not, uh, when I'm not getting a swoop. I'm surprised it is even possible for me to do that, though. careful not to touch the edge of the pencil. Um, Mario cannot... can't gain height with flight if his movement speed decreases to zero. And it doesn't look like I'm gaining height, but I am. Uh, once I stop gaining height, I start losing height, which uh, I can't really recover from. I'm actually super surprised that I just hit that P switch. Considering how much trouble I was having hitting the P switch uh, 
on purpose. Oops. We're at a little bit over an hour. The fastest players to finish this level took just under an hour. And, uh... I'm getting to the point where I think I'm going to get into the next section as soon as I can get in that pipe again. I might be able to make this work. It's going to be ex extremely close. Yeah. Uh, Jessica, thank you for the heart me. How's it going? Yeah, no, for sure. <sighs> We're doing the ROM hack race level from tonight. Um, I actually didn't get a chance to participate in the race because I had to um, help out a little bit with an emergency at work. Luckily, the part that I had to do was very, very small. But it's, uh, it had to do with something that's very, very important. Eh, it's going pretty good. I feel like I was pretty successful in the things that I tried to do today. Except, uh, I sabotaged myself. I have a, um, an electric lawnmower. And I went to go cut the grass this morning. And, uh, I have two batteries for it. And I neglected to charge the second battery. Which meant that I wasn't able to get hardly any grass cutting done. What do I do for work? I'm a system administrator. I work in IT. I forgot to charge the car one day. Oh. See, I would like to have an electric car. Just because, to me, it's more of a pain to have to go and buy gas than it would be just to plug in uh, at home. No, no, no wild lawn mowing accident story. It's been pretty reliable. Yo, Patrick, thank you so much for the galaxy. And the heart me. Can't forget that. And the raid earlier, which I will always make fun of you for not taking part in your own raids. That's that's not how Twitch works. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> getting dive storage there. See, that's exactly what I'm saying, Morgan Eddie. That that's that is the reason I would want an electric car. Just eliminate the vast majority of maintenance. I can see you, Lorraine.
Man. I'm, uh... I think I'm trying to pull back on the cave too fast. That's what's making me go backwards. Okay, we're good. All right, I've got it in the pipe. No! <laughs> Oh, that's so close. Oh, man. 100% that's what I do, though. Yeah, so the, the Metroids, what they do, they don't actually hurt me. They keep me from gaining height while jumping. And I need... I need to do a small jump to get to that pipe. Because I'm not going to have my cape. I have to damage boost the munchers. Yeah, that was really close. <clears throat> that was a new one. All right, in the pipe again. I jumped too early. Not GG. I'm under the assumption that once I get through that next pipe, I'm dead. Uh, once I get through the next pipe, there is going to be a midway. Not on that first one, though. Perfect. perfect this is a really really cool level so far very very unique Subscription, and at the same time, wait, was that also a TikTok sub? I get so confused by the TikTok subs because I can't see them except for the alert. Okay, I've got the P switch. Oh, thank God. <laughs> uh... 
What the heck? Oops, you forgot to make it a 12 room castle without checkpoints. Uh, that's funny. Maybe next time, Nyx. I need flight. Like regular flight. Do I need. Do I need to do like, um. An ordinary sticky fly? <clears throat> I guess what I'm asking is if I'm going to need, uh... Yo, short. If I'm gonna need... A stored dive. Yes. I can't... Let's go imagine why. Let's go new <laughs> oh god <laughs> uh so that was the text of speech <coughs> and it got maybe a little bit broken <laughs> nah. I have no no idea how that broke that way. Dang it, pencils. I am going to operate under the assumption I need to keep flight. <laughs> hmm. That would make for a good clip. RITTS, I'll miss you. Gonna practice more disco shell, have fun. <clears throat> I've heard, um, <coughs> I've heard the TikTok text to speech break like that before, like the one that they actually have in their app. But usually it's a lot harder to do than that. <coughs> yeah, I think disco shells are fine. It just takes a lot of practice with them. The thing that I don't like are the flying disco shells. Perfect, thank you, Al. Good luck, Jimmy. Have fun. I think it's perfect that that happened with Gladys, though. I need to Cape Pound at least.
Oh no. Okay. Um Is that actually going to give me height? <clears throat> <laughs> Those beans were incredibly flicked. I might need dive storage. <clears throat> Hello, Softlock. <laughs> Block penalty for attempting Kuso cheese. I learned it from watching you, Nix. I'm just looking at the way that that hallway is shaped. I think I just need to do a turnaround. Like that, <clears throat> but pull up instead of going straight into lava. And I think I'm storing, uh, storing a dive state there. <clears throat> I'm also going to need to slow down, I think.
Thank you guys so much for the likes. I really do appreciate them. We hit 3,000, and that's nothing to sneeze at. <clears throat> uh, Lord Hoyle, thank you so much for the subscription. <clears throat> I appreciate it. Have you figured out a way to actually see subscriptions on TikTok? Because that is something that has eluded me so far. I need to plug my phone in. About to die. <clears throat> Surely, after we get to the uh, the end of this room, that pipe is another midway. <clears throat> That's a bummer. I wish... I wish there was, like, a... like a dockable chat window. Like, if TikTok allowed a, a pop-out of chat and then made it work, um... Automatically when a when a stream starts again They're so bad about providing tools though <clears throat> I always run into a problem where I I open the chat window too early and it doesn't read anything because the stream wasn't active at the time when I was starting all my stuff. Like, the amount of stuff that I need to do to get a TikTok stream working after the broadcast has already started, it's just ridiculous. TikTok worst platform. <clears throat> I get it. I get it. Wait. How? I, I think I get it. I feel like I'm in incredible danger of losing the Galumba, though. Yeah, so there's a sprite killer down there. That's going to get rid of the Metroid, which will allow me to gain height. I 
I don't have flight at the time that I'm going to get down there, so I can't just cape to get back up. Um, instead, we're going to do a Galoomba jump, which it's already set up for me. I just need to not get stuck on the beans. <clears throat> so, when I have that Galoomba in my hand, I need to be falling down to the right and then turn left so that the Metroid on my head hits the Sprite Killer but the Galoomba in my hand doesn't touch the Sprite Killer. <clears throat> and the timing seems like it's going to be very tight. This is why I have the lava pools to die in, <clears throat> for when I get stuck. And <clears throat> when I don't need to see the bottom anymore. Which I'm, I'm pretty sure I have a good understanding of everything I need. I'm so worried about losing that Galoomba. <laughs> no, the Galoomba jump is... It's gonna be fine. It'll be timed out for me. I'm just trying to think if there's any way I can, uh... If I can get started faster. <clears throat> I might need to do some fast falling. We'll see. If I do, that's going to make it significantly more difficult. Thank <laughs> you. 
Did I just miss a subscription? I feel like I did. from Ryan. Ryan, thank you so much for that subscription. I really appreciate it. Give me one second to look at the thing real quick. Yeah, I heard just like the very end of it. to it in just a minute. I'm, I'm looking for a setting real quick. the setting I was looking for and it already wasn't doing the thing I was trying to tell it not to do. <laughs> Slightly too low. Touch the ground. Also too low. Zeratrus. I'm like consistently pulling up way too early there. So the ROM hack I was playing before uh, before I ended stream earlier, I unfortunately didn't save my progress in it. We were like 22 out of 25 exits in, and I'd have to start it all over again. I, I think I might just leave it where it's at. Ha, 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 ha. 
Uh, oh, I got anxious. I went too fast. The reason I went faster is because I got stuck very briefly on one of those beans. That was very, very close. I think the last time that I got down there, I forgot to turn back to the right. I, I think just now I got down there without touching any of the beans. And it was still super duper tight. It may have something to do with how I am trying to reset the timer on the Galoomba. Yeah! It's his, uh... It's Nyx's debut for ROM Hack Races. It's a super cool level, too. I might just try to go for it, like not try to reset his timer at all. Set. Uh, I think that's going to work even though I didn't hit the block. No, I also didn't turn back to the right. Please do not cape the Galoomba. <laughs> no. <laughs> That's the thing I was worried about throwing him in there. Let go! Let go!
I have an idea. I was too fast. No! So what did I do wrong? Did I not get enough speed on the Galoomba? I really thought that was going to work. Cape should be making the Galoomba jump slightly easier. Because there's no there's no timing I need to worry about. Unlike what you'd normally see. This is cool. Please be a midway. Yay, it's a midway. Looks fun and you want to play more cape? Oh, that's... <laughs> Whoa, Aniv. <laughs> So anyway, and it started blasting. for the GG and for the pipe. <clears throat> yeah, it is pretty hard. Um, honestly, that first section was... Uh, Probably going to be the hardest bit for a while, unless this is incredibly difficult. It's a down vine. Oh. 
not much was down by with you. <laughs> or I guess not much what's down with you, Vine. Perfect. Mm, less perfect. I want that really, really slow speed. that. And <laughs> just ever so slowly losing height there. And then I started to panic. It's really funny. Uh, this song that's playing right now used to be the uh, the song that would play when you visited my MySpace page. <laughs> I mean, the fun thing about my space was being able to go through and make your own page so that it was a destination for people to go to in my opinion at least get a good look at that vine. I'm not sure if that's a down vine or an up vine. difficult for me. I'm, uh... I'm doing the same thing I was earlier. I still didn't get a good look at that top line. I 
Okay, that is an upline. I think I'm already dead, though. I'm definitely getting more control over this. Which is cool. Pretty much. Oh. My run button is, um... Giving me some issues tonight. Not good. Might need to open up my controller another time. This is a very, very interesting kind of flying. It's an entirely different kind of flying altogether. It's a raid from Bunker Games. Hey, Bunker. Did you do the race level tonight? Fun cape. It sounds like you did do the race level. It. I like it a lot. Uh, that second section was really cool. 
The first one, I, um... I struggled a lot after getting past the pipe. And then it hit me that... Like, at exactly the same time, I realized that I could take the P-Switch with me. And, uh, how to actually make use of the Sprite Killer. Once I realized that, uh, I needed to bring the P-Switch with me, uh, there's only a few more attempts in the pipe. Hang on, one quick second. We're going to take a short break so I can show what this dog is doing. Hopefully I've not already woken him up. What he's doing is he's snoring. You probably can't hear it, but it is so loud. He's got his little face mushed up into the wall. He's so dang cute. <laughs> I was worried about waking him up, but he's, uh, apparently sleeping really well for once. I bet if I stood up, he would, uh, he'd wake right up, though. Which means I can't try it. <laughs> treats and snoozing, snoozing and treats. We need to do some more doggy school sometime soon. I'd like to teach him a couple more tricks. Hey, Peaches, thank you very much for that heart puff gift. such a weird flight state sometimes. Is it because I'm holding a direction? I think it is.
<sighs> that was actually super close. <laughs> I got up buttoned. My, uh, My right to left flick is not very clean. Well, I guess both directions aren't. a huge Fallout fan. I liked Fallout 3. And that's the only Fallout game that I've played. me. I, I don't think that I would have enjoyed any of the Fallout games before 3. I've been seeing ads for the TV show. Like, incessant ads. What's that on, Amazon? Amazon Prime. I'm having very bad experiences trying to watch shows on it now because of the ads. I've never been uh, watching a whole lot on Prime Video. But it's difficult. They have stuff on there that I want to watch, but 
I don't want to have to put up with ads, and I don't want to pay any more than I'm already paying. Because they keep raising the price on Prime. That's the part that's really irritating. <laughs> I don't think that's how that works. <clears throat> yeah, it sure would be nice if there was some way that you could get access to these shows without having to subscribe to all the different services and without having to watch ads. What is it now? It's like 120 bucks or something. I forget about it until it renews automatically and it's super painful. Oh. <laughs> Right, Nix? level hard. I've got Plex set up. Um, I've not been adding anything to it for a while. Oh, here he is. sleepy. He's twitching his feet. He was working his mouth too. He's being very, very sleepy. Prime to watch a video in the first place. I have it because Amazon Prime is so valuable. To me, at least. Oh. 
I wonder if I should intentionally try to grab that down vine. I think that Amazon Prime is uh, also the only streaming service that I'm paying for. Kind of. I don't know what else I would even consider at this point. Maybe I sh yeah, I I'm gonna try grabbing that. Next time. I should check what benefits I'm even really getting from Prime anymore. Climbed right off that vine by accident. not going to work. Oh yeah, the the prime sub. Prick. That was really good speed and I messed it up. Wait, what? I was completely looking away, but somehow I caped it. Hmm. <laughs> That's a really bad idea. <laughs>
What if, though? What if it was just barely possible? controller Whenever I get to that spot, it's just so narrow and I can't... I can't control my speed well enough. <clears throat> Yo, thanks, B2. This has been really cool so far. Purposely take damage. I need to have enough iframe suit in the pipe. I also can't that that um, the munchers that are to the left of me. It's too much height to get up to the next ones without being able to fly up there. First section body do? Hey, me too. <clears throat> I 
by far the part I spent the longest on. I felt like I got pretty good at it towards the end, though. I probably can if I can get over to the the munchers that are just to the right of me right now. I probably can just damage on on those munchers and jump my way up to the pipe. But I've not even had the chance to do that one time yet. You probably need the cape. <laughs> I just want to see. You gotta do so many of these in a row. So that's something I'm really bad at, is uh, telling what speed I'm at. Um, maybe if I memorize the chart, it would help. Oh. 
but just given the way this setup works, I don't think that it's even possible to uh, easily get a odd speed. I'd be sacrificing a lot of height to do it, I think. Yeah, that shirt. Rebel, thank you so much for that heart media. Yeah? Yeah, and if those are those are speeds, all right. Hola from Colorado, well, welcome in. I think we're approaching the end of this level. I think. <laughs> oh, how are the fur babies? They're doing good. Um, I need to make sure I give Aaron some pets because he's being very cute tonight. Oh. He just woke up and stretched. He stuck out his tongue. How's the run going? Um, it's going fine. This last section is really kicking my butt because it's got uh, some unusual things to do. Light. I I really want to turn around as little as I possibly can there, but it involves getting good speeds. Good. That's also good. No, Satan, get away from me. There's an H. <laughs> I was about to cry. <laughs> I don't I don't feel like that needed to be an H, but thank you, Nix. Redemption for section one. <laughs> Oh. 
Okay. I have an idea. The idea is not to get touched by <laughs> the Metroids. <laughs> It's just crazy enough of a plan that it might work. <laughs> no, surely not. Hey, Tingly Spice. Thank you for that, Harmony. Welcome back, CJ. So maybe, maybe if I jump a certain number of times, they'll just shake off my head. They're making me think of the Micro Goombas. Can I just make that? No. jump. <laughs> I'll look at the, uh, the Chorizo statue. It's a good looking Chorizo. sort of get the feeling that I'm going to feel really dumb when I figure out how to actually do this. Okay, that's progress. <laughs> Good steps. Alright, I, I think I actually know how to do it now. Not like that. That's a sick level. That's really, really cool. Oh, man. Look at all those people.
<laughs> I'm stuck. <laughs> Help, I'm stuck. Yay. All right. Well, that was super cool and also super difficult. I'm glad that I took the time to play that. Um, I wish I had actually made it to the race. Let me, uh, let me look at the leaderboard and see where I would have been. <clears throat> hey, last place. Just behind Bunker. Uh, but seventh place is absolutely nothing to sneeze at. We take those. <laughs> oh, man. I don't know what I was expecting, but... I don't, I don't think that was it, but that was really cool. All right, yeah, uh, that's gonna do it for me tonight. Um, I'm gonna try and be online again tomorrow. Uh, me and Al should be doing Bread and Fred tomorrow. That's gonna be fun. Uh, TikTok, thanks so much for being here. Hope you guys have a good rest of your night. Uh, and I'm going to go ahead and turn off YouTube as well. We're going to go ahead and raid somebody, though. Let's see who's online that we can send a raid along to. Yeah, Brendan Fred has been really fun. I'm, I'm really looking forward to playing that tomorrow. Uh... I see some friends online. Tell you what, we're gonna go raid. We're gonna go raid Risto, who's playing Baron. He's on the ape level, Baron. That's gonna be cool. All right. Uh. Ooh. Almost botched that real bad. Nice cape, Nick. That was so cool. Have a good night, everybody. It's over. It's over!